A harsh blow today for Colonial Williamsburg employees. The Colonial Williamsburg Foundation announced layoffs. The president and CEO says the foundation has lost hundreds of millions of dollars in the last five years. Our Allie Weatherton was there for the official announcement. Williamsburg has been on the forefront of history and of America. It's a place to learn about the past. The locals are the ones who know the real history of Williamsburg. And it's those workers who remind tourists what life was exactly like back in the day. It's a sad day. I mean, we wish that it didn't come to this, uh, but it has. Today, some of those local workers learned they were out of a job. 71 were laid off. 262 employees will have the option to work for an outsourced company for at least a year. And 22 employees will transfer jobs inside the Williamsburg Foundation. We're very much aware that there's a concern that this is just the first shoe and another shoe is going to drop. We tried to structure this so that we do this one time. Mitchell Reese says they did everything possible to try and fix the financial issues. But the sad truth is that it wasn't enough. It wasn't enough to put us back to sustained financial stability. The four areas being outsourced are golf operations, retail management, landscaping, and commercial real estate management. Reese says he's hopeful for the future. Uh, trust me, nobody wants to go through this again. And we think that we have a solid plan that will lead us to financial stability by 2019. Now I'm told those employees that will leave their jobs this month will get a month of health care, a severance package, and will also be able to go to a career counseling center to get their resume up to speed. In Williamsburg, Allie Weatherton, 13 News Now.